Good morning guys! So it is Saturday morning and I decided that I'm going to go ahead and vlog this weekend because I have some interesting things going on. Um, so I am going to have my hair done today and I'm actually going to have it fixed because well, not, like, there's nothing like wrong with it per se, but I don't know if you guys notice, I'm sure there's so many that notice and are actually quite excited that I'm doing this, but and for some reason in my videos, I am downstairs and I have all the lights shining on me and for some reason, ever since being blonde, it really, like the, the lights really pull out the yellow in my hair and when I'm editing the videos and people have commented that your hair is so yellow and I totally agree, like it really is in my videos, but in real life it's not. Um, I use purple shampoo so I'm, I'm really like very conscious about toning my hair so that it's not like a brassy color, but when I am editing my videos, my hair is so yellow. I can't take it anymore. So I am going to be going back to the brown that is my natural hair color, brunette. So I'm not going to go like 100% just like solid color brown. I hopefully am going to keep some of the highlights just a little bit just to give it a little bit more dimension. But overall, like when someone looks at me, I want them to think, yeah, she, she has brown hair. <laughs> So anyway, I know there's people out there that love my hair blonde and there's people out there that really always comment saying that they loved it the old way when it was a lot darker. So I'm not going to please everybody. Um, I love it both ways. I, I don't know. But anyway, so then the rest of the weekend, I actually have been a single mom. I mean, not like really. Um, my husband's actually been away for a work trip for two weeks. So I have been playing the role of a single mom um, for that long. I've been going to work full time and then at night it's just like super busy, which is fine. I mean, like people do that 24 seven, like that's just their life. And that's like, that's awesome. Like I seriously commend you. I mean, it hasn't been terrible, but it's definitely been a lot more busy than normal. And I'm also trying to get the same amount of videos up and everything. So when they go to bed, I'm like filming and editing. It's just like, ah, it's just a lot. So anyway, we're going to go pick up Josh tomorrow. So I'm going to take you guys along with me through everything. And I hope this is a fun video. And see now in this light, because there's the, these white lights right here, it's pulling in the yellow. It's really weird. I feel like if I'm in normal lighting that isn't like bright white, my hair looks good. But this is like super bright white lights and in that lighting my hair looks yellow. It's so annoying. So in the last clip I think it looked okay, but here I'm looking in the mirror and I hate it. Um, but let me just quickly show you what I'm wearing. It is like my new, one of my new favorite. It's like a, kind of like a sweater. I think I might actually feature it in a video, but I also wanted to show you this bralette that I got. So this shirt is from Revolve and I know it looks basic from the front, but the back, can you even see it? it? It's way open in the back and I love it. And I paired it with this brand new bralette. I just love bralettes. I bought my first one from Express and I've been wearing it nonstop. So I found other ones at Nordstrom and I got them in so many different colors. Um, I got, this one's like an off white and I got it in black. I just got them in a lot of colors and they're only like $20. So I will link this shirt below. It's by Revolve and it's like seriously one of the softest materials and just the open back is just so cool along with this bralette. So I'll link the bralette down, down below too because that it just allows you to wear like your shirt so many ways and it's just so comfortable. I feel like you can sleep in them. It's just, I really recommend the bralettes. Okay, so I am getting ready to go. I'm gonna probably leave in like five minutes, but I'm quickly sitting on my computer here. I have Pinterest up and I'm looking at some of the hairstyles and I know that when I go to get my hair done, she can't do it like identical to the pictures, but at least she'll have an idea of kind of what I'm looking at. So here's my computer. I literally just searched um, brown hair with highlights and here's what came up. I guess I kind of like how this one is, you know, there's definitely a brown hair, but there's a little bit of like a sun-kissed blonde look to it, but it's very, very subtle. And then I really like this one too. This is definitely like she has brown hair, 
but it, there's still some like blonde a little bit in there. And so maybe that's what I'm going for. I guess I'll probably show her those two pictures. But overall, like I said, I definitely want to look like I have brown hair. And my mom just got here, so she's going to watch the boys while I'm gone because Josh isn't home. So I do just want to mention that like over the last two weeks, I definitely have had some help with my mom and my mother-in-law. So I am in no way like all by myself here. So that's definitely been nice because I know there's people out there that just don't live near family at all. And they literally are completely on their own with kids and that's so hard so let's go to the salon I don't know if I'll be able to film in there because it's so dim like it's one of those salons where like the atmosphere is like cool and like just dim and I just think the lighting is is gonna be awful so I, I might just in I don't know we'll see what happens Alrighty, so here's the before. I know I think I already did it before, but look, it's pulling the yellow. It's pulling the yellow. All right, so let's go, let's go in. Alrighty, so I'm in the bathroom. So she has my hair mostly um, covered with dye, but she actually left this part down here completely bare because she wants this to process first. And then she's gonna add on some, a little bit of a dimensional color down here to kind of like make it a little bit um, just not all one shade. So I think she knows what she's doing. She kind of like pulled different shades through my hair and then, you know, like I said, wants this to process first. So we'll see how it turns out. And like I said, it's super dim out there. I mean, it's enough for her to see what she's doing, but it's just the lighting is just so bad. And it's actually not like very good in here either. It's very, very yellow. Ah, so here we are. It is the finished look. I'm definitely a brunette. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think it's really pretty. I think she did a good job. I wanted um, it to be very dark up here and then slowly kind of gradually go to like a lighter shade. So um, it's not definitely not all one color and I wouldn't quite say it's like the Bayolage. Is that the right word? Yeah, I don't think it's quite that, but it is kind of just like a sun-kissed look down at the bottom. And my hair feels so soft and smooth. You know how like when your hair is blonde, it's like, it's just a little bit more coarse because it, they strip away all of the pigment. And now the pigment's like back in my hair and it just feels so incredibly soft. So I know my hair will definitely lighten up a lot because you know, the blonde still is under there. So right now is like the darkest it's going to be uh, and I feel like it does look a little bit harsh right now But I really think even in like a week. It's gonna be a lot lighter um, But anyway, yeah, I like it I keep freaking Taking a video of myself when I'm trying to take a picture. I'm I'm freaking dumb Alrighty, why don't we tell everybody where we are? Jason's Deli. Is that good chocolate milk haze? Yeah, I think we should save some. Later. So we have like a gourmet meal here. Here is a sweet potato with all this really yummy healthy stuff on top. And then Pax has grilled cheese with apples and there's a cheese pizza. And I got a club with gluten-free bread and included. fruit. Included. It's included. This. What is? Forks and knives. Oh wow! It even came with forks and knives. Ah, oh, hey! There's Pax and there's Hayes. Was that fun? Is that super fun? Yeah. See ya. And there they go. Whoa. Oh my gosh, people, you would not believe what just happened. So I was watching Pax and Hayes in the playground, like play gym area, and I was kind of focused on Pax just because he was doing something kind of cool. And Hayes must have like snuck out the, the exit, not like the exit of the building, but like the exit of the little play area. And he ran to the arcade, which isn't a big deal because the arcade's like right there and I can easily see that. But I didn't realize it at first. And he immediately ran to this basketball machine hoop thing and he climbed into the machine. So a man had to go get him out and he was crying. I was mortified, like I'm a terrible parent and oh just like I want ball back. and he just wants the ball back but no. so that was just one of those moments that you're gonna look back in parenthood and probably remember like always yeah that was just that was mortifying <laughs>
coffee cup round two and I'm gonna be putting this in this is the best it's bone broth protein it is so good for so many things um, I do it more for my teeth but it's great for your joints skin muscles detox it's just fabulous it's especially tasty in coffee just the chocolate I have also have vanilla but I don't really like that that much but the chocolate is so good in coffee seriously This is my room, and this is my dresser, this is my toys, this is my comfy chair, and this is my air purifier, this is my bed. And this is Baby Haze, except you're not a baby anymore. My turn. Your turn. Do you want to show them your room? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go show them your room. This is your bed. You have an air purifier too, and your dresser. Really not much to it, and your nice comfy chair. Your little turtle. Oh my goodness, people. I, um, I tried this Sanctuary by Kat Von D, and someone commented in my Sephora haul video, because I, I did get this at the Sephora VIB sale, and it, it, when I opened it, it looked kind of purpley, and I was like, oh, maybe I'm gonna have to return this because it's, you know, it's really purple. But then someone commented saying it's their favorite color and to make sure I try it. So I just tried it on and I love it. it I mean, it definitely does not look purple. It has like this dark, I mean, kind of a purple undertone, but it's kind of like a brown undertone too, and it's so pretty. So it's definitely great for fall and winter. I'm really, ah! I'm really excited about it. Hello. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Hi. Are you excited to go get daddy? Yeah. That was intense. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. You almost fell off the bed. This is why we shouldn't jump on the bed. So we need to get packs for these all the way downstairs in the basement. So I decided I'm going to open the laundry chute and see if you can hear me. <laughs> this is the fun things we do to waste time. Yell packs. <laughs> okay, wait, let me try. Let me try. Mommy. Okay, I'll try. Paxton! Can you come upstairs, please? Okay. Oh. So we're at a stoplight here and we're on our way to meet Daddy or Josh or whatever. Um, so we're actually gonna meet him at Ross Park Mall. I really don't go to Ross Park Mall like every day or anything. And that that's like Nordstrom-ish area. And the reason I say that is I feel like every vlog I do I somehow manage to be in Nordstrom. It's kind of ridiculous. But anyway, the reason is because I just, it's kind of like a good meeting point halfway between the airport and our house. and. Let's just be real, I actually just want the Cheesecake Factory nachos. So I was like, we should just meet there. And we're just gonna hang out and I think we're gonna, I don't even know what we're gonna do, but we're just gonna have a little fun day out because Josh has been stuck in Kansas. That's where he was. He's been in Kansas learning how to fly a different airplane. Um, but anyway, so it's green, so I'm gonna go now. I'm in the back. I know. Oh, I've been shaking, I love it when you go crazy. You take all my inhibitions. I got a boyfriend. Like so embarrassed to walk into that place. I don't. Sorry if you guys do, but I'm. I don't think I could do it. I honestly don't think I could. Alrighty, so we're here at the mall, and we're gonna go find quantum packs. Gotta keep up. We're walking in the parking lot, so we have to be safe. Um, but we're gonna go find Josh, and it'll be really exciting. Okay, say shit there. All right, say shit. Can't talk. Okay, Shay said they're here, so I'm gonna go out and meet them, and let's see what they, how they. So. Yay, there he is. Hey. hey guys. Hey buddy. Oh, it's so good to see you. Hey buddy. Hi, I miss you. Oh, Hello. Cool. I have a hug. You're so big. It's cold. It's so cold. Can we do family hug? Yay, we're back. We're together. It's been a long two weeks. I mean, it's actually gone like okay, but it's for you. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we're at the mall. We're gonna go get some food at the Cheesecake Factory. 
Come sit. Oh, my little buddy, you're so big. Come over, get in, get in the camera. Come on. Oh! All right, so we're all together. We're gonna say bye. 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 Say bye. Bye. <laughs>